subscribe to the Tech Zone Daily for a chance to win a tablet of your choice. What's up YouTube, this is Dan for Tech Zone Daily here with an unboxing and first look of the all new Blackberry Playbook. Let's not waste any time here and we'll just go ahead and unbox this guy. So let me just pull off the cover. So I'll flip that upside down. Here it has some information in different languages in regards to how to activate the device. You need Wi-Fi in order to activate the device because there will be a software upgrade. So I'll just slice through the tape. Playbook has a 1 GHz dual core TI OMAP3 processor. Oh wow, what a pleasant surprise. RIM has actually included a seems like a neoprene pouch. Which is pretty good thing. Um, if this was Apple, they'll probably charge about forty dollars or so for a pouch like this. And um, yeah, I would like to see more companies actually adding on accessories to their devices. Saves us some money. So we'll put the playbook to a side and we'll dig in some more. Here we have some information, and um, actually the the manuals look like a playbook. So the information is within a playbook, and they're in different languages. I'm really digging the color scheme of the box. It looks pretty good, very trendy. Playbook has a next generation operating system which is entirely new, it's called QNEX. RIM calls it the Tablet OS. Now let me just go ahead and slice this open. This should be the charger. Yeah, so here we have a micro USB cable for your charging and syncing. You can charge this through computer as well but it does take some time and we have the brick charger there's another way of charging it fast there's a fast connected charger it's a dock I'll talk about that later I'll show you guys the port and finally let's see what we have inside here so here we have um, other manuals that we would never read and also a cleaning cloth the playbook has a very industrial look to it very minimalistic it has some weight to it. It is packing a punch with the 7 inch form factor. I really like the back. It has a soft mesh plastic. It really feels good in the hand. That was just a brief first impression. Look forward to our video review soon. Now let me give you guys a quick hardware tour. So at the top we had the ambient light sensor and the 3 megapixel front facing camera which can do 1080p HD video recording. Playbook has a 7 inch capacitor touchscreen with a pixel density of 1024 by 600 it has an HD ratio. On either side we have the speaker grills which seem to be flushed in so it gives it a minimalistic look. The bezel around the screen is touch sensitive so you can command different gestures by just swiping up and down. It's a very intuitive way to interact with the OS. One prime example of this is just to awaken your playbook with a swipe of your finger. At the top we have the power button which is kind of small but you don't necessarily need to use this to turn on the device. If it's asleep, you can just swipe your finger as I showed you. Right beside it, we have the volume up and down rocker and in between it, we have the pause slash play. You can actually press both the volume buttons to get a screenshot. And finally at the end, we have a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. At the bottom, we have a micro HDMI port to sync it up to your TV and view it on a larger display. You can actually do cool things with it, like hook up a Bluetooth mouse and use it like a computer. And right beside that we have the micro USB port for your charging. Finally we have the proprietary rapid charging port which costs about $60 for the dock and it should charge less than half the time it would take on a conventional method. At the back of the device we have the 5 megapixel HD camera 1080p HD with 30 frames per second which is pretty good and a simple Blackberry logo. Just for a size comparison I brought along some of the competing tablets out in the market a Motorola Zoom and an iPad 2. I'll place the playbook on top. Don't forget guys, if you're a subscriber to the channel, you could win one of these tablets. If you're not a subscriber, go ahead and subscribe because I'll be posting up a giveaway video shortly with all the guidelines. Thank you for watching this unboxing guys and if you do like the video, make sure you thumbs up, it really does help and I'll see you on another video. Take care, peace.